Yo my dudes, welcome back to the vlogs. Uh, so today we're going to start off with a mini build series. Uh, let me just explain what I mean. Um, a few of you guys that are following me on Instagram or that have been following the build do know that I do still have um, my standard front bumper as well as my standard or should I say my OEM front bumper as well as my OEM rear bumper. However, uh, it's not standard because the rear bumper does have um, an original Stanley OEM rear fog light as well as the front bumper does have fog lights as well. So, um, besides the front bumper and the rear bumper, I do have a few other um, parts stocked up. I still do have obviously the full interior. Um, I'm not quite sure if I'm going to go to that extent. Um, but a lot of you that do know me do know that during winter time I kind of have a, a, a winter look. Um, so that is basically the whole build series. Um, the whole plan is to basically transform the car uh, into a different look. Currently it's in its uh, track form. Um, so I do plan on changing the whole look. I'm not quite sure uh, in what direction I am going to go in yet. However, I am going to change up the bumpers. Uh, just give the car a whole different look and then when summer comes again I'll just um, I'll just go back to the track look again uh, besides changing up the bumpers um, I am going to start off um, with the steering wheel or how can I say my new um, filming device uh, we are going to sand this down and then just spray this and then also I got of these um, studs just so that it looks a bit better um, so that is what we are going to do today and then we are changing up the front bumper okay guys so just to catch you up to speed again um, if you don't recall in the previous video um, this is what I am going to use for my filming um, like I said like before I got this on Wish um, so the whole plan with this is basically to put this in over here as well as we are going to put the this, this spoon decal um, or gel sticker in the center we are also going to spray this black so it looks a bit better and then use these studs um, just to make it look more realistic uh, these are also um, my visors my mirror visors um, these are actually also for the winter look um, so I am just going to reuse them again um, so basically just going to sand this now and then have it sprayed and then also just fit um, the little child sticker over there
Okay guys, so this is my EG8 front bumper. I know it is a bit worn out. I'm sure this can maybe just polish out um, this little circle here. I recall a Subaru actually with the HKS exhaust reversed into me. I think this was still at N1 City um, McDonald's. And then this is the Mugen front lip, which will be running. I might just put my SIR lip on, however, um, if I do, I do actually want to spray this whole bumper over and then I also want to spray this bottom in here because if you uh, do recall, the SIR um, lip basically sits over here and then this is exposed so I actually want it to be read completely um, similar to the EG6 but in the meanwhile, we are going to spray this black like we did on the silver EK and then I might just take off this lip over here so that it has the same chin effect as the spoon lip Okay guys, so the front bumper is on right now. Uh, just to explain what this tape is for you actually. With a fiberglass lip it usually scrapes so you can actually see these white marks over here. That's why this tape so that it doesn't damage the bumper any further. Um, some of you might have noticed I haven't plugged in the spots. I am not a fan of yellow spots. So I'm not actually going to run the spots. It's mainly just for a day look. But I'm not going to run the spots at all. I'm just going to finish up um, the spray work on the steering wheel and then put the front lip Final result with the steering wheel. This is the rear. As you guys can see, I used a glue or a glue gun or hot glue um, because I didn't want to fully commit to actually putting um, uh, or gluing this here because I might just use the steering wheel or maybe even put it on the EK. So, yeah, that is why I used um, the hot glue. But I do like the outcome. If you guys do like what we've done to the steering wheel, please do give this video a thumbs up.
my dudes so if you're watching this just like to thank you for making it to the end of the video then also if you guys are as excited as i am for the new winter mini build series please do give this video a thumbs up and uh, then also just like to ask you guys for some feedback um maybe just mention down in the comments below what you'd like me to do to the eg next uh, then also just like to thank you guys for liking and subscribing hope to see you guys in the next video peace